Yeah, as the drama surrounding the arrest of Senator Dino Milaye continues to unfold, Nigerians continue to observe in the hopes of understanding. One issue that caught our eye at the other news was the story of the distinguished senator allegedly escaping police custody by jumping out of a vehicle. Well, for more on this, we turn now to our senior crime scene and forensic correspondent, Dandy Humans. Now, when Senator Dino Milaro was arrested, he believed he was going to go to an Abuja based facility, which, by the way, he has been preparing for months. I was already prepared to go to prison. I have my tissue paper. I have my toothpaste. I have my brush. Now, Senator Dino did not tell us that inside that bag he had a compass. And that compass was what showed him the way to know that, hey, this bus is beginning to change course and is moving towards Lokoja. And with his safety concerns in Kogi State, he remembered his famous quote. You speak the truth, you die. You lie, you die. I, Dino Milai, have chosen to speak the truth and die. So he said to himself, if I jump, I die. If I don't jump and reach this Lokoja, I still die. So I, Dino Milai, will jump and die. Fortunately, he jumped and didn't die. Now, what got our attention here at the other news is how did the Ajako Yanoja Kruna jump out of that vehicle? So we are going to go into an on-the-spot forensic analysis. Now, from the videos we see, Senator Dino was weeks away in a Toyota Hyatt 14 seater bus such as this. Now, you will know for sure that he will be sitting anywhere from this seat to the back. And this front seat will always be manned by an armed officer. Now, how possible was it for him to go through this armed officer here and then unfasten the secure button here? to jet, jump out of the bus. Now, they, they say that he fled through the window or he jumped the window of the bus. Now, this is it. This is the window of the bus. Now, how did he escape whoever will be sitting here to bring out his head and his shoulder? So jump out of this bus while it's in motion and you have seen his shoulder. It's possible his leg to his waist can pass, but his shoulder to his mid region. Somehow. Now. The police also reportedly say that two Hilux vans double crossed this vehicle. So is it that when they double crossed the vehicle, the all the policemen in this bus all came down to fight Hillocks, leaving their detainee alone. The only explanation to this is that Senator Dino, realizing that he was on his road to Damascus, went into praise and worship. Do you know CYB And from that prison worship, it graduated to the point where police might have been thinking that, ah, this guy don't enter seizure. And then they must have said, okay, come down, come take breeze. Like the only explanation to that. That makes sense. We are also lost on the timeline of events between that sitting position to when he was in this stretcher position. Could it be when the police said, Get into this bus? He said, No, I prefer another means of transportation. By the way, where did the ambulance come from? How did the ambulance leave that scene to the hospital? Another report said, he ran into the bush, and from the bush, he ran to the hospital. Are you trying to say that a man disendowed outran our own Nigerian SWAT? <laughs> mm. 
Indeed, in this matter, there are more questions than answers. And if somebody does not start telling us something now, we will suspect that there's more hand in this soup. So if you're out there and you really know the truth, come forward and say it. You will not die. From the other news, Command Center for Investigation and Forensics, I am Dan the Humorous. And remember, you didn't hear this from me. Yes. <laughs>